Hey everybody, it's Pookie TVX. Uh, so it's a song I've been listening to, well, album I've been listening to, and it's um, uh, Meek Mill's new album. I wanted to give a shout out to Meek Mill's man and stepping his shit up, man, and continuing to, you know, grow as a um, as a man. You know, because it shows in his music from when he first started through all the shit that he's been through as a real nigga and it's, and it's, it's hard to get through this shit and it's, and, it, and, it's, and it's showing out in your music brother I want to give a shout out to you man cause this shit every track banging every motherfucking track banging you know what I'm saying I've been, sma I've been slapping that shit for the last uh, two days now <laughs> you know what I'm saying digging in on the song man and um, and, um that's, that was free Niggas need to really listen to that to that track, man. Play that track over and over again, man, and get and get, and get what them brothers are saying in that track, man. Cause that's some that's some that's some real fucking knowledge right there from some niggas that's you know that know what the fuck they talking about. You know what I'm saying? So I mean, that's the actually the first time I really li even listened to a new age CD. Or 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 a album. Cause I rarely listen to this this bullshit they got out now. It's just that, that's just some that's just some bullshit. But um, that Meek Mill, that shit right. That shit right. That that's that's how that's how you bring back the lyricism in the fucking music, man. All that other shit people don't even understand what the fuck you saying. Y'all can say that shit because it means nothing. They only they mainly listen listen to it for the beat. Cause what y'all saying ain't shit. That's just that's just facts about it. Well, yeah, I like to give a shout out to Omeek Mill for that man. That was a good that was a good a good album you put together, brother. And you collab and you collabed it with some cool ass people. You know what I'm saying? First of all, you know it's gonna be uh, a hit if uh, if uh, if Jay Z on there, Hove on there. So you know it's already certified. Got the fucking stamp on it. Is is that's that's it? You know. And then you throw in some uh, Rick Ross and and um, Cardi B and uh, you got a nice little album, man. I heard it's like topping the music and shit like that, man. Keep doing your thing, brother. Show these people that people can change. People can change from where they were in the beginning. Just because you were in somebody's penitentiary or jail cell don't mean you can't be running a goddamn company. Or carving out a lane for you and your family. Legit. See, that's the thing. They see hear all this dumb shit on the rap music and they think all of us do are on that dumb shit. It's just it's ridiculous, man. And I, and that's what they label us as. That's, oh yeah, just put anything on. They're gonna listen to it. They're gonna, you know, they're gonna they're gonna vibe to it, whatever it is. So just put somebody mumbling. You know what I'm saying? With some with some dreads in their hair and some fucking lipstick and shit on them fucking sad, man. <sighs> fucking sad, man. I remember when you used to have to have, you used to have to have flow. You used to have to have, your shit had to mean something and show the way to get out of it. This music nowadays is showing you the Wear painted fingernails like a little bitch. Put on lipstick, put color in your hair like a little bitch. Feminizing the male gender. It's 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 just disgusting, man. The music is just disgusting. That's why I only listen to underground bay music. You know what I'm saying? Down south music, you know, shit like that. I don't, I don't listen to that shit to come on the radio, man. For what? For what?
even even the radio, even the people that's playing the music, I, I, they should be slapped in their motherfucking face for playing that shit. Especially the one cat, what's his name? Funk Flex, Funk Master Flex. His bitch ass. I don't even want to get into the story about his bitch ass. That nigga so fucking ho. Talk about some Tupac shit, nigga. Like, nigga, Tupac was fucking... A fucking genius in the booth, nigga. Hands down, a fucking genius in the booth. When that nigga came to the studio, wasn't no fucking playing. He knocking out songs like it ain't nothing, and his songs mean something. If it was about thugging, it was about thugging. And then you can go into how you can escape thugging, how to evolve yourself. He was a hoods nigga prophet. And to pack all that music in the little lifespan that he had, it could never be duplicated. Not the way music is going today. Hell no. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And you can say the same for Biggie. But for Funk Master Flex to go back and say some shit on Pac that he know damn well he would have never, never, ever, 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 ever say no shit like that in Pac's face. At all. So he think he can let the shit die down and think that, what, you, what, you think Tupac still ain't got no fans or friends? That's going to let that shit ride out of your punk ass mouth. <laughs> He's a sucker ass nigga, man. You keep playing that bullshit rap. You play on your goddamn show, nigga. You play that shit. I believe you part. That's why you still. That's why you still making it. Because I, I believe you part of that LBGT community, motherfucker. I believe you undercover bitch. And I said that. Yeah, I'm a nobody nigga from East Oakland. You know what I'm saying? A normal nigga. But I said that. And I stand on that. You only succeeding because you one of they puppets. You one of they little bitches. The LBGT community gang. Nigga, you part of it. You little fruit loop. You little fruit loop from the hood, nigga. You out there with fucking Nature Boy. With his old nasty S STD infected ass nigga. Somebody need to find that nigga and, and kill that motherfucker. Talking about he Jesus. He, he, he talking about he the coming of the Christ. And he fucking boys. Fuck out. Right, man. I can't believe that nigga still breathing, man. It's a whole nother video coming about that fuck, nigga. But that's the category that you in, Funk Flex. Pussy. You sit behind there and run your fucking mouth with your painted fucking beard. And the only thing you scare is the bitches that you slap, nigga. And you only know how to do that because you get it done to you. Bitch made ass nigga. And Nature Boy, something coming for you, motherfucker. Y'all get ready for it. The video, Nature Boy. Show you how it wraps around in a funk master flex. Two hoes. Again, Meek Mill, shout out. You did your thing on this one, brother. Let's keep it, let's keep it going. Keep that same fucking energy. 
If we get these pussy niggas out the hip hop, nigga, we could be able to make the hip hop right back again the way it was. And folk master, what fucking latex? Get your bitch ass out of here, nigga. Thug life, nigga. I'm out.